amazing how many people I'll run into ever since I became principal of Osborne who will say, Osborne High School, I graduated from there, my grandfather graduated from there, my grandmother, or they have some recollection of the school. What's even more amazing, though, is that most people, though, if you say Cuff County and the words are Osborne High School, they'll go, that's a Cuff County. Go, so, yeah, it's a Cuff County. Yeah, it's the oldest high school in Cuff County. And if I say the words with teachers or something like that, they'll go, oh, yeah, yeah, I know, that's cool. I go, thanks, that's good. <laughs> but there's reasons why that happens, right? Why most people don't, don't know about the school. And we'll get into some of those reasons in a little bit. The community is unincorporated. It's part of Cobb County that does not have a town. And most of Cobb County has some sort of town or wealth that's built up around what used to be a town. Um, where Osborne sits, it's always been unincorporated. Even back in the, the 40s, it's interesting to talk to the graduates from that time because they'll tell you that they were thought of as the, you know, those kids who were over there in the outskirts. They were, they were the, um, their dwells on the outside of town, that type of thing. And so it's interesting because that reputation has kept
say this kid can't do it, this kid won't be successful, this, that, the other, so forth and so on. Those are barriers. Those are walls, right? The kid's never going to be able to be successful in a classroom if you've got the adult saying things like that. And then the kids do the same thing. I can't do math. I can't do science. I can't get up. I can't go to bed. You know, that type of stuff. I can't stop playing my DS. <laughs> the point is, is that all of us have these walls and these barriers. And they, they're excuses to stop them from being able to succeed. Right? And so with all that, hey, how's that for getting that out of a cartoon? Right? Right? <laughs> but the point is, is that that's why I keep talking to them about it. To the point that I even have graduates when I've spoken at local elementary schools. We have teachers here from one of the schools. When I speak of local, uh, local elementary schools, I have some of the kids who graduated before who they're with their siblings, and they're watching me, and they say at the end, I was hoping you're going to show buzz like you're going to show 